And welcome wherever you're watching. This is Goodison Park. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined for expert analysis by my partner Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Everton up against Southampton. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. And here's how Everton line up. Jordan Pickford begins in goal. Michael Keane plays alongside Yeri Mina in central defence. Alan starts alongside Abdoulaye Dukure in central midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Clean challenge. And here's how the lineup looks for Southampton. Alex McCarthy is the goalkeeper. James Ward Prowse starts with Oriol Romé. And in with a real chance. Can they slot it home? Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow, Stuart. What do you think we'll see from him today? Well, Derek, he's so dangerous in the air, but it's not just his aerial ability, it's his movement in the box that buys him that little bit of space to get on the end of crosses. Whether it's in front of defenders or drifting in behind them, he always seems to be in the right place. Ward Prowse. And space for the cross. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. Luca Digne. Gray. And now Dominic Carvert-Lewin. Coleman. And will be a bit annoyed to have lost the ball. Ward-Prowse. Che Adams, chance to do damage. Will he play it in? Defensive efficiency personified. Oh, good vision. Covert Lewin takes the shot, and the keeper showing tremendous command. Well, no escape, not an immediate yellow card, but the referee deals with him now. Well, they're going for the short one. Across, lacking guile and accuracy. Romain Perrault. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. Gray. Jay Adams and they have possession again Alan here is Digne well oh, that's a super ball over the top Digne could be and a goal that will do it they've been pushing for it and now they've been rewarded Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. Go for 
So the match has restarted. 1 0 here. Moving into the advanced position. Elianusi. Making sure it didn't get past him. Richarlison. Gray. And a chance for him on the flank. Dinia. And he stopped them in their tracks. Genepo. Promising attack, this. Well, they want that equaliser, but the passing remains smooth. It's opening up for them. A real challenge for the goalkeeper. Well, nearing the half-time interval, it's Everton in front. And Stuart, as always, we value your opinion as regards their performance. Yes, they've defended really well all over the pitch. Their work rate and discipline has been excellent. But any drop in tempo and this lead could easily slip away. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Can he keep his composure? Not out of the woods yet. Well, what a brilliant save that was. I can't believe he's kept that one out. Salisu. And a throw in forthcoming. Ducure. Calvert Lewin. Teammates available. Richarlison. Good pressure. Can they make something of this? Able to deal with the threat. Townsend. Calvert Lewin. Whatever way you look at that, it's been squandered. And so it is, the first half story has been written. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the plate. So they get the ball rolling once more and it's advantage Everton after the first half. Let's see what the second 45 has in store for us. Gray. And now Dominic Carvert-Lewin. On the ball, Richarlison. Ducure. Excellent vision. And behind it goes the concession of a corner here. Now the delivery, and the danger cleared. Calvert-Lewin. And now Dominic Calvert-Lewin. 
So a throw in here. Jack Stevens. Oh, stylish ball. What can they do now? And the assistant referee has raised his flag offside. Alan Gray on the ball Richarlison Calvert-Lewin well sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game Coleman Townsend in position oh he couldn't outwit the keeper Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. Playing it short. Real defensive commitment there. Armstrong. The ball with James Ward-Prowse. Ward-Prowse. And 30 minutes left for play in this match. Richarlison. Lucatinha. Townsend. Everton moving the ball forwards. What can they do from here? But into the keeper's gloves. Armstrong. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. But nothing comes of it. Alan Richarlison. Well, they did have the ball, but not anymore. Genepo. Now, can they make something happen? And a significant block following that cross. Able to clear the danger. Corner kick, though, here. And with play stop, they will make the change now. Number 14, Andros Townsend, to be replaced by number 17, Alex Iwobu. Substitution for Southampton, coming off the pitch, number 19, Musa Gineppo, to be replaced by... And he's fired over the corner, and the problem not completely solved. Calvert-Lewin. It will be. On the ball, Coleman. No high-quality defending. Promising-looking attack from Everton. Dinia. And it's Tom Davis. Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. Covert Lewin, and that'll be the goalkeeper's ball. Could be! Oh, a 
smart save to keep the minute. Well, that keeps it interesting, but they're running out of time here. So the corner played into the box. No two ways about it. A wild, wild attempt. Well, it's so hard to get this right, and he just couldn't adjust his body quickly enough. Just ten minutes to go. Well, the ball lost here. Tom Davis. And here's Alan. Richarlison. A fine use of the ball. Ducure. Moving into the advanced position. And it's Tom Davis. Let's see if something comes of this. There it is! A fantastic goal! And no wonder he's off celebrating! Well, as you can see here, the build-up is patient, it's precise and penetrative, which opens up the opposition. But the keeper should do better at his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. Well, a second goal for them here. Oriol Romeu. Armstrong. Well, possibilities in the centre. Ball's gone. Ducure. Richarlison. Here is Digne. Well, he has the measure of his man. And the flag is up, offside. Well, that's just a lack of awareness. He was clearly in an offside position. Substitution for Everton. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Coming onto the pitch, number eight, Fabian Delft. in there to take it away Che Adams Redmond this looks promising and they produce the arrears you never know they still believe in themselves Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. So the referee blows for full time, and it's an Everton success story, whatever way you look at it. Three points for the Toffees. What did you think of their performance? Well, Derek, what a good finish to the game that was. They just wore down the opposition, and in the end, they got their reward. That's a really good win for them. Well, he often cuts the figure of a thinking person's footballer, and Stuart, he's thought his way throughout this match. Well, it's a good performance. He worked hard, played well, and scored a goal, and his team won. What more could you ask for?